Okay, hello YouTubers, this is Eric at Flex PVC. What I've got here is a simple stand. I'm going to show you how we use this. So it's a what I call a take a partable stand. Um, what you've got here is just two levels. I do not have the four uh, horizontal pipes in the bottom, or the five-way on the bottom, just because for demonstration purposes we really don't need it. Uh, here's how it works. Take it apart. You could leave all this together, just take this apart, put this together with these if you want, like this, right? So you can throw it in a box or another piece of pipe to hold it all together, or easy enough just to take apart. Okay, so now I will show you the fitting that makes this work. And to understand what we're doing here is we're putting three quarter inch pipe through inch and a quarter fittings. So, <coughs> Here's the reducer bushing that allows that to happen. Okay, so oops. there we go. This is the part that goes into the fitting. This is the part that goes out. You do not have to glue these in. It is an extremely tight fit. These right here, I just pounded them in. This is the T on the top. This is the cross. And then obviously the inch and a quarter is on these ports here, okay? Uh, one thing I do do is I chamfer these. It just makes it easier to put the pipe in and out. Just a simple knife. Uh, yeah, okay. Simple knife will do. Or you can use a fancy chamfering tool like this one here. Like this. Got a thing inside. Okay, either one of them works fine. And I do the same thing with the pipes. I put a chamfer on the end. Again, you can do it with a knife. It takes a little bit longer to put this one on, but I can do it. Or you can use the uh, chamfering tool, which does a real good job. Makes it real fast in the pipes. Okay, so uh, put this together. These just slide in, just like this. It's right on through, like that. Okay, so I'm going to put it back together for you. Bottom. Uh, here. Got a focus for you. Cross. Inch and quarter vertical. T on the top. Obviously, this is just two levels. You can gang as many of these as you want. Make it as tall as you want. You can set it up like this. You can move your bars left and right. If your uh, stand comes out way on the uh, on the bottom, then you can. It's real stable. You can do whatever you want with these bars. Uh, turn them this way. Turn them that way. Add stands, or I mean, add, sorry, add levels. Uh, the other thing you can do is you can make a six way here. You can make a Christmas tree. You got a six way, six way, six way. Up at the top, you'll have a, a five way. And what you'll do is you'll put your reducer tip bushings here, the telescoping reducer bushings here. Uh, but on these ones here, you still put them in there, but your pipe obviously is not going to go through. But it will go all the way in and it's going to hit this pipe. And it's still very sturdy. It depends on what you're hanging on it, but if it's not too much weight, that'll work as well. But for a simple towel bar or something like this, uh, exercise equipment, whatever you guys are using with these things for, this is the way it goes. So, oh, let's just make sure my focus is, yep, still good. Okay, oh, you can't see the bottom, sorry. Okay, so we'll go down here. Not that it matters, but there. Okay. All right, so I hope you found this uh, video useful. If you have any questions, give me an email. Or, uh, or call us uh, Monday through Friday, 10 to 4, 1-888-782-3539. And the email address is on our website. Top right corner of the page is a blue circle with an envelope in it. Or with an envelope in it. And you click on that and you can send us a, a question for the emails, okay? Uh, this part here is this uh, telescoping bushing. I just type in telescoping into the search box uh, and it brings it up for me. Uh, the official number is something 12R07. Yeah, okay, so the official number is 4453-12R75. Okay, so 12R75. If you type that in the search box, it'll bring it up for you. All right, hope you found this useful. Thanks for watching.